it is um, considered to have a 100% fatality rate. Bats. They eat pesky insects at a rate of 1,000 bugs an hour, and they act as pollinators, helping the environment. But when one gets rabies, it can become a silent host for a deadly disease. can't always see a bat bite because their teeth are so tiny that even if it bites you, it doesn't really leave a mark. That's bad news for heavy sleepers and for one Moorestown resident who woke to find a bat in her bedroom early last Thursday. She called our office and we had her capture it and we sent it out for testing and it came back positive for, for rabies. Prompting the resident and her pet cats to receive a series of shots preventing the virus. There's no test um, for humans to see if they have rabies. There's no blood test or anything. Um, so we just determine it by um, evaluating their risk if they were exposed. Once transmitted through saliva from a bite, the virus is unforgiving if left untreated. Once symptoms start to show up, it's too late to receive any vaccinations or do anything about it. While bats are the most discreet hosts, plenty of animals have been known to carry rabies, even household dogs and cats. Pets should be kept up to date on their rabies vaccinations, and if you encounter a bat... If anybody finds a bat in their home, around their home, near their pets, capture it. Try not to damage the head or, or kill it. Just capture it and give our office a call and we can help determine if it can simply just be let go because there was no exposure or if we think that there's a reasonable exposure and we would want you to bring the bat in to have it tested. In Plattsburgh, Paris Fawn, NBC5 News.